Simplify the expression as much as possible. Cosine x times tangent x times cosecant x. Okay, well, I'm going to start by rewriting tangent x using the tangent identity. So it's going to be cosine x, that stays the same. And then tangent x is going to be sine of x divided by cosine of x. And then I'll just leave cosecant x. My next step is going to be to rewrite cosecant x using a reciprocal identity. So we're going to get cosine x still, sine x over cosine x still. And the change is going to be right here. It's going to be 1 over sine of x. OK, next step, I'm going to write this as all one big fraction. So it's going to be cosine x times sine of x in the numerator, and then cosine x times sine x in the denominator. So I use this cosine x right here, and then the sine x in the numerator goes here, and the two denominators, cosine x, sine x, go in the denominator here. Now, cosine x sine x divided by cosine x sine x is simply 1. So 1 is our final simplification of cosine x tangent x cosecant x.